business book and why? The very first one, The Lords of Strategy, if you're curious about what strategy is and how the consulting firms got started, The Lords of Strategy is a great book. It goes through the history of consulting. And you think about it, essentially, these are people saying, for a ton of money, we're going to come in and tell you what you're doing wrong. That's a hard value proposition. It goes back to the 1950s when I think it was Boston Consulting Group was one of the first ones. Maybe it was Bain, one of the first ones to kind of start out on that and go into companies and say, hey, here's what we can do for you. Another great book. This is an easy read, a fun read by David Rubenstein called How to Lead, interviews that he's done with all the great leaders, Oprah Winfrey, Ruth Bader Ginsburg, Bill Gates, and just a fun read. I would read that one a second time as well. And then a recent book, way too thick, by the way, but called Power Failure, which is about the collapse of GE, the history of GE, starting with Thomas Edison, how they got started, and then the glory years of the 60s and essentially the 70s, really 50s, 60s, 70s, maybe early 80s, but then effectively yep. in the 90s, kind of turning the corner and being the GE they are today, which has now just been split up into, I think, three different companies. So anyway, fascinating stuff, but I love that question, and I happen to enjoy reading business books because it's sort of like sports you know it's like a competition to see who wins the game and then the winner gets knocked off eventually so it's always a fun story on that front wonderful well, thank you.